Hello, in this video, I am going to demonstrate one point perspective, also known as parallel perspective, and the condition is the picture plane is passing through. So, this is our picture plane. The picture plane is passing through, not touching above or below. So we consider the picture plane red as P, P, which is passing through the block. Okay. To construct that, first what we should do is, we need to fix our SP, means spectator point, and vanishing point. These two are important for any perspective. So here, since this is only one point perspective, Anywhere you can take, draw a straight line first, like that, okay, anywhere, left hand side or right hand side, and at whatever distance, because the, as the distance increases or decreases, the ultimate view or the final view will be having an impact. So definitely, if it is very close, it looks bigger, if you move away, it looks smaller. So in this condition, I want to fix my vanishing point here this is my VP because again we are trying to draw the aerial view or bird's eye view here I am fixing my SP that is station point or spectator point that is from where we are viewing this block or building that is called a spectator point once that is done we need to fix our ground line because that forms our base. So, I am drawing a line which we consider this to be GL. That means it is ground line. Our VP, SP and GL are fixed. Now, we have to locate A, B, C, D this plan has to be drawn on this in the form of a plan of one point perspective. We should convert that to plan in perspective. For that, we need to take the help of our SP. We'll draw from SP. We can draw one line touching B. From C, I am drawing again, repeating the same. If I draw from C, touching picture plane somewhere, A also I am drawing, or all the four. Since this is passing through, we need to identify all the four points A, B, C, D on the picture plane. So they are touching here. The D, D is touching here. I represent a small D. A, see, A is here, but it's touching here. So, this becomes our A. C is touching here. The small C, this point. B is touching PP here. So, this is the B. Once this are one A, B, C, D we got, first thing what I would suggest is drop lines from so, since this is passing through to identify easily, I will write A, B, C, D. I will write this point as P and this midpoint as Q. So, we have to plot P and Q here. To do that, simply we need to draw line from here onto ground or GL. I am dropping. So as I said, GL and PP are interconnected or interrelated. PP is passing through P and Q. When I drop the line on GL, this becomes P and Q dash. So that way we need to represent P, Q, PP. So P, Q, GL, this becomes P dash and this becomes Q dash. So P, Q, P dash, Q, picture plane, 
on GL. Once we get this, we need to take the help of the VP. So here, first from VP, I have to draw line passing through my P dash. Again, repeat the same line passing through Q dash. Over. So once that is done, so from VP vanishing point projected P dash Q dash lines on these lines I have to find A and D is lying on P B and C these points are lying on Q means B and C will come this side A and D will come this side so for that we have already plotted D A C B we simply have to drop first I will drop to find A I want to find A. So simply I'll drop a line. So A is here. It's touching PP here. So from here I'll drop a line onto this dash. P dash line. So it is touching this. So this becomes A dash and B is touching here, here C. So from here I'm dropping a line. It's touching the Q dash line here. So this becomes B dash same way D and C also I will draw C so I will take C so C is touching here so I will drop a line from C I am dropping a line here so this is C and D I am dropping a line so it is touching here so this and this okay becomes our this becomes D dash this becomes C dash this becomes A dash this becomes B dash so we got the plan so I'll complete the plan first okay to complete the plan I'll use A and B I'll connect D and C I'll connect done over and I'll darken a bit B dash C dash I'm connecting A and D dash I'm connecting now we can see A B C D in plan in perspective PQ is the center so PQ is center so our plan PP is passing through GL is passing through so our plan in perspective is correct now only thing we have to do is add heights to add heights the height is given as six units so here also we have to take heights from GL always so this is our GL okay so we are supposed to take heights on GL that is Q dash line so here we will take six units it is coming here so this is the height line this becomes height line and from here I took six units once I get this height I need to project from vanishing point onto A and B dash I'll connect C and B dash C and B and I'm just simply drawing a line passing through so C dash so somewhere here B dash somewhere here so we got this too once that is done we need to draw parallel lines simply C B C I'll draw a line parallel here also I'll draw a parallel line till here so see I got this this and this line I'll connect D dash onto VP D dash to VPC. I'll do connect this to so definitely I got a dash point and this is the top okay so we have completed our perspective one point perspective the condition is picture plane passing through so I'll darken this for better understanding so this one I'm darkening a b d C all horizontals once 
okay all verticals now the verticals you can do this way b i am connecting b no need to connect this so we have to connect only c we need to connect d so i got the front and one side we will complete this by connecting d to a on this line vp line so definitely i'll connect this to this a you got and here i'm connecting c to pp so automatically i'm connecting this to and here also i'm connecting this one the base or bottom so this completes this completes our drawing where picture plane is passing through the object Thank you.